Welcome back to Crafty Hackers. We've got some new Barbie outfits that are good enough to eat. These mouth-watering fashion crafts are gonna hit you right in the sweet tooth. But first, make sure you show us some love by subscribing, hitting the notification bell, and clicking the thumbs up button if you liked this video. And as always, some of these crafts require adult supervision. Ready for a sugar rush? Let's do this. Let's start with this scrumptious popcorn outfit. First, smush a ball of fondant to make it fit around Barbie's torso and mold it together in the back. Use licorice rope for the stripe. Just measure to her body and cut. Do this all the way around. Have your parents help you cut the fondant with an X-Acto knife. Now it's time for the popcorn. Stick the popcorn to Barbie with yellow cake icing. It kind of works like glue. Apply a couple of rows of popcorn all the way around. And that's all there is to it. Who's ready to go to the movies? This candy girl outfit is super easy to make. We're going to turn an extra large marshmallow into a skirt for Barbie. Have your parents help you poke a hole into the center of the marshmallow and stretch it out so it fits over Barbie's legs. Dust a light layer of powdered sugar all over the marshmallow so it slips right over Barbie's legs. Then mold it to fit her body. Now grab your trusty fondant Sprinkle it with powdered sugar and roll it flat. Cut the sides so it transforms into a cute top. Arms up, Barbie! Carefully trim it to size with an X-Acto knife. There we go, perfect fit. Let's spruce this up with some yummy candy. Skittles or M&Ms should do the trick. White cake icing makes a pretty yummy glue. Choose any design you want. We added a little slit in the skirt so Barbie can still run and play. And for the finishing touch, use a strip of candy for a choker necklace. Just cut the candy strip to size with an X-Acto knife. Wrap it around your neck snipping the ends so it fits just right. A little hot glue will hold it into place. But don't eat this part. Hmm, make her a little bracelet too while you're at it. Isn't this look candy-licious? Yum. All that's missing are some tasty boots. Fill a glass with about five spoonfuls of powdered sugar. Squirt in some lemon juice concentrate and give it a stir until it forms a paste. Add more lemon juice if you need to. Then add some food coloring and stir some more until it becomes gooey like slime. Time for a dip, Barbie. Dip her legs to coat them and add some cake icing at the top. Totally adorbs. Ready to kick it up a notch with this edible ball gown? So are we. Start by making the same powdered sugar mixture as you did for the boots earlier. Isn't it fun to smush up a sponge cake? Crumble it all up, then add your powdered sugar slime. Massage it until it's a doughy consistency, then form it into a cone shape. Next, roll out a piece of marzipan and turn it into the top of Barbie's gown. Push it together in back and trim to size with an X-Acto knife. Aren't these candy hearts cute? Push them right into the marzipan. 
See how easily they stick? Now apply some silver and white candy sprinkles. Just stick them to your finger and press them into the bodice. Now, grab an ice cream cone and form the sponge cake dough around it. Push Barbie's legs into the dough and form it around her to make the skirt. Take another rolled out piece of marzipan and wrap it around Barbie's waist and hips. Cut this drapey triangle out in front. Make another batch of powdered sugar slime and color it with red food coloring. Time for the most fun part. Drizzle the red goo onto the skirt. Spread it evenly with the back of your spoon. Once it hardens, draw an outline with white icing, like this one. Let's give her a delicious headpiece too. Fasten a red licorice rope around her head. Then use cake icing to attach some bite-sized candies. Cut candy vines into little pieces and stick them on too. Barbie is ready for the ball as a delicious candy princess. Now let's turn Barbie into a sweet girl of summer. First, make her bikini top with red cake icing. Time for a sweet shower, Barbie. Now do the same for the bikini bottoms. You can also apply the sprinkles with your finger. Add some straps. And don't forget the backside. Let's hit the pool party. Now let's make a school outfit. You might want to wear gloves when you massage the food coloring into the fondant. Keep adding food coloring until it's the perfect color. Roll it out and trim the edges. Let's get dressed, shall we? Attach it in the back with red icing and trim away the excess. Now, do the same for the skirt using a different color. We chose blue. Use cake icing to glue the skirt to her body. She won't mind. Trim it at an angle and give it a cool, stylish detail. Now, roll out a thin strip of fondant to make a belt. Then, trim the skirt and top with white icing. Add this cute little detail in the center a few dots along the bottom. Isn't she lovely? Let's get our hula on with this tasty ensemble. For the skirt, cut a bunch of candy straws in half up the center. Then glue a candy strip around Barbie's chest. Careful! Next, cut a strip of Airheads candy to fit around Barbie's hips. Cut 
the straws to the size of a skirt. And hot glue them to the candy belt you made. We know we don't need to say this, but you should never eat candy with hot glue on it. Yuck! For the final touch, add a gold armband with gold cake icing. Let's hula! Before we go, we've got one last outfit that's pretty awesome, if we do say so ourselves. Let's journey back to the days of the Roman Empire with this toga-inspired look. Grab yourself a white mystery Airheads candy and get ready to transform it. Cut a strip and wrap it around Barbie's hips like a belt. Then cut a few slices of gum in half. And glue them to the Airheads belt. Gold cake icing makes a gorgeous top. Then trim the top of the skirt with this jagged design. Add dots underneath like this. Wasn't that easy? And Barbie looks awesome! Hey girls, let's go party! We had a total blast making edible Barbie outfits with you. Thanks for watching Crafty Hackers. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more crafty hacks and ideas. See you later.